this is my baby. I'm, I'm the uh, co-owner, because Chris, my husband, and I have owned it together for seven years. What I do here is I spin a lot of plates, <laughs> or I um, connect a lot of people. The Southern Alberta, whatever it is that's in the air or in the water, comes through in all these different ways through artists expressing themselves. What holds the collection together, I think, is these artists are, are working in the same time and space. So all of my artists are living and they're all creating <clears throat> generally within about a hundred mile radius. So there's a kind of an ethos that I think comes through whether you're painting or creating jewelry or um, making a bronze sculpture that is the prairie ethos or the foothills. Um, but that doesn't mean that all of the art actually shows literally that subject matter. It's more, I think, this time and this space. The most important thing to me is the actual act of creating. People who create are people I resonate with. And people who create because they can't not create are the kind of artists that, that interest me and that I am interested in representing. And, and so what the, whatever it is that they create is what we end up showing on the walls of the gallery. And then the next most beautiful thing is when people fall in love with that thing that an artist has created. And that's my joy is to be at both of those intersections with the artist who's making the work and the people who are falling in love and wanting to take it home with them or gift it to someone. <laughs>